Okay. I think I don't need to feel guilty that I killed that bloodsucker at the bathroom. Do I? Hmm. But I still do. And I warned it since last night. I kept it there, showed the way to the ventilation. It didn't go. Then I thought maybe it's not a good exit for flying creatures. Maybe there are spiders waiting and it knows. I did not want it to be trapped, so I left the door open and made an effort to shut the door of my bedroom. In case you know. Because I normally keep the doors open. Didn't analyze why yet, but uh, not so fond of shut shutting doors. Alright, yeah. I also left the balcony door open one whole day. After that I did the cleaning of the bathroom. I even sprayed some odor afterwards. It's not my favorite, you know? Fake odors? But anyway, just in case to scare it away. <clears throat> in case it hasn't gone yet. And I also told her to go away. Once silently, once singingly. I cannot imagine, after all, the message does not go through. And guess what? After all that effort, it was still there. Now. Waiting and buzzing, like they always do. Yeah, so I attempt to flush it away. I miss first, but it has slowed down already somehow. And second, uh, it was gone and done. So, yeah, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to think about this? That maybe it wanted to die? And that it wanted me to kill it? For whatever way, I f still feel sad now. Replacing the buzzing to inner thoughts. Yeah. Two hours later, in the bathroom, imagine that picture. Damn! No! Damn! Still here! See? You should know what you wish for. You should know what you soap for. One day later in the kitchen. Okay. Okay, you're still here. As you found your way out now, this is something good. It means there is some hope. I will neatly place you in a jar. Let's see if there is a cardboard. I don't dare really touching your leg. Off the balcony. Go now. And bless me.